Mars has always been our friendly neighbor in the solar system alignment. The red planet is the next celestial object closest to us after the moon. Even though it's 55 million kilometers away and takes around 40 days to get there using the fastest spacecraft launched from Earth. However, Mars has many Earth-like characteristics as it has solid ground, a thin atmosphere, and water in the form of ice caps. And thus, many people have been considering the possibility of colonizing Mars for a very long time. One of those individuals is Elon Musk. Elon Musk is uh, currently the owner of SpaceX, which is an aerospace company created with the main purpose of reducing the cost of aerospace transportation and making interplanetary colonization possible. One of the main drives for wanting to venture to other planets is in order to avoid a doomsday event that could potentially wipe out the human race. And such a doomsday event might occur when nations decide to use nukes on each other in wars. And this would no doubt eliminate most traces of life on Earth. The first challenge that Elon must tackle is the amount of money required to make such a trip possible. Right now, it costs over $10 billion per person for an individual to be able to afford moving to the red planet. And so, it would be optimal if the price per person required to make such a trip become less than half a million. When the price reaches that level, there will be more people on Earth who would be able to afford the trip. And one of the keys to achieving this affordability level is the ability for us to constantly reuse the spaceships and rockets used to fly there and back which means that the spaceships we use must be able to fly to Mars and also fly back in one piece. According to Musk, the spaceships should be designed so that they can fly around a thousand times each, and the trip will happen when Earth and Mars align favorably, and this usually happens once every 26 months. The whole spaceship system is termed as the interplanetary transport system. Eventually, there will be a thousand of these ITS spaceships flying around, with each spaceship carrying a hundred people. With this plan in mind, we should then be able to get over a million people on Mars within 50 to 100 years, with say having two of these space trips every year. In order to travel further than Mars, Elon also plans to set up refueling depots in various celestial objects so that it would be possible for a spaceship to travel further without running out of fuel. This is very exciting because it means that mankind will finally become a multi-planetary species. The first manned flight to Mars is currently scheduled for 2023.